It's just Louisa and welcome back to my channel. I'm gonna keep this intro very short Basically me and my family went on holiday to Devon for five days a couple of weeks ago And we had a really good time. And I thought I'd vlog it for you guys Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video big thumbs up if you enjoy it and subscribe to my channel if you're new Because it took me so long to edit this Um, I tried to like make it quite good because I like to look back on these vlogs in a couple of years We wanted to go to like North and South Devon like Solcombe and places like that But we there was actually no availability so we just stayed up in North Devon so the next clip will be me setting off in the car to Devon so if you're not familiar with my channel I live about five hours away from Devon ended up taking seven hours I hope you enjoy it I'll see you in a bit so we set off at about half past six in the morning and we had about six hour drive and we stopped off at the service station to get our breakfast hi guys we're having our lunch in South Morton it's like on the way because we're so hungry and it's taken like seven hours to get here so yeah I've just got a plant of fruit twist um, so yeah, I'll probably see you guys when I'm at the hotel. Okay, we've just arrived at the hotel. My face looks so red. I've been in the car for eight hours, so ignore me. But here's the room. To be fair, we did quite well considering like literally all hotels are like booked up completely. And this was like not even that expensive either. It's quite relatively cheap. It's actually quite a big room. So here's like, that'll be my parents' bed and that's mine. And then, yeah, it's quite spacious. There's a sofa. And then these are just wardrobes. And then in here is the bathroom, but my mum's in there, so. Here's the bathroom, it's just. Oh, this mirror is quite good, actually. Does it light up? I don't know how to do it. This big mirror and shower. So yeah, not too bad. Um, it's like half past three, I think, or like, no, it's like four o'clock. And we've got a table booked at quarter to six because there's literally no availability in any restaurants for like the whole of July and August. So we had to book go quite early, but that's fine. Um, so yeah, I'm going to get ready. I'll see you guys in a bit. Okay, so when we arrived in Ilfracum, we went to go and visit one of the beaches. And then shortly after that, we went for tea at a really nice Italian restaurant. And we saw this statue, which was quite interesting. And then we saw this like speedboat and there's loads of drunk people like shouting at it. It was quite funny. We then went to a bar. I was convinced that my drink got spiked though because it literally made me feel so ill afterwards, but it tasted good. Hi guys, so it's now the next morning. Sorry that I didn't really vlog yesterday. I got quite ill last night, but I'm not gonna talk about that. So we just had breakfast and I'm in the car and we're going to Woolacum Beach or Woolacoon. So I'm going surfing today. I've got a surfing lesson, which is really exciting. We then went to visit Woolacum Beach. It was so busy, but the beach is absolutely massive. We then just stayed around the beach for the morning. Well, I mean the morning, I mean two hours. We paid £10 to park and we literally stayed for two hours because I needed to head off for my surf lesson, which I already booked. Um, so we went over to Croyd to surf and this is at the Croyd Cafe. The place where I went surfing was called Baggy Point, I'm pretty sure. If you just type in Croyd Surfing, it's got like five stars, it's the best one. Uh, I literally loved it so much. It was one of like the best experiences ever. Like I didn't know that I'd enjoy it so much. Uh, so yeah, I'm definitely gonna go back and surf another time soon because I literally loved it. Um, and I managed to stand up on the board pretty soon, which was really good. After I finished surfing, I actually lost my parents. It was quite like scary. I couldn't find them for ages, but then I finally found them and we had an ice cream at the like cafe at the surf place. Just got a salted caramel ice cream. Just been surfing, it was really good. We then spent the evening in Ilfracombe and we watched the sunset because it was so pretty. We walked up this really big hill um, and we just saw the amazing views and my dad took some clips of me in the golden hour uh, and then we headed off to Weatherspoons for some drinks. It's just in Weatherspoons, uh, the beach. Good morning guys, I look like I've got a black eye, it's sunburn, I don't know why I look so red. What I do is the sun because I always get burnt. Well, I sometimes tan, like I burn and then I tan, so. Um, it's our last day in this hotel because we're going to a new hotel. This hotel is in Ilfracombe, Ilfracombe. It's not our, like, it wasn't our first choice. We wanted to stay in Willacombe or like Croyd or like Saunton Sands, somewhere like near, you know, like the big beaches, but there literally was no availability because obviously like most people are staying in England or like in the UK because of like travel restrictions. So like 
all the hotels are booked up um but yeah we've had a really good time so far sorry that i haven't like done many like talky clips but like i just kind of want to enjoy my holiday i don't really want to vlog like in front of my family all the time but yeah i went surfing yesterday which was so much fun in croyd she enjoyed it that much that i think i might have either a surfing lesson today or um i might hire a surfboard because it was so much fun um i really enjoyed it and people in my surf group were really nice as well and the instructors were really nice they're really good looking like they had they were like proper like surf boys like you know like i feel like surf boys like all look the same like not look the same but like you know they just have a certain look about them like, sort of like long like blonde hair really tanned like ooh, wow um <laughs> anyway there's another one with like brown hair tan skin and i spoke to him in the sea okay never mind yeah i'm gonna um go to breakfast because my parents have gone without me because i'm so slow also tmi boys if you're watching this please skip past but i sat my period yesterday like literally just after i finished surfing which isn't ideal but i mean I, i'm happy that i didn't start it before surfing but it's just a bit annoying for my holiday seeing as like a lot of it i'm going to be spending in water like in the sea and in pools because the next hotel has a pool so what can i do natural things so yeah i might show you guys breakfast actually because i didn't show you that yesterday um but the weather looks gorgeous again we picked such a good weekend like not weekend like week because well we're staying for five days but the weather's gorgeous it's like 28 degrees every day which is so nice i'm just wearing a little pink like beach dress Oh, you can't even see. Just over my bikini. And then I had a really nice bikini on yesterday. Like, I was wearing a really nice neon one. But today, I've just got a, like, purple lilac kind of one. It's quite cute, but it's really old. But never mind. So, yeah, I'm just going to go to breakfast. Because I'm hungry. And my family have left me behind. So, for breakfast, I firstly had some peaches because I freaking love peaches. Here were the views from the room. It was really, really pretty. The hotel was really... Well, it's a guest house. And then I had some toast. I'm not a big breakfast eater, but I still really enjoyed the breakfast. It was really nice. Okay, so we're just about to leave the hotel. If you want to know where we're staying, it's called um, Wildercombe House. Okay, so the following morning we headed off to a beautiful village called Clavelli in North Devon. Honestly, it was literally like Instagram heaven, like the streets were all so pretty. Okay, so we're just in Clavelli. There's loads of people staring at me. Just had a cream tea. Basically, my dad went to the Royal Agricultural University in Sirencester, so a lot of his friends are farmers and a lot of them live down south. So we went to go visit one of his old friends and their children who live in this village, like so lucky, um, and they were really lovely. Here's me walking up the street really awkwardly because loads of people were staring at me. We then went back to the hotel and I had a coke and sat in front of the pool, which was really nice. Hey guys, so it's now the evening. It's like 7 p.m. I think. And we're booked to have tea at 8.15, which is quite late, but like, you know when you're on holiday and like you just kind of lose your appetite because it's so hot. Today, I didn't really vlog that much because I was quite busy and I didn't want to get my camera out all the time, but I got a few clips of Clavelli. Apparently it's the most Instagrammable place in the world. According to my like dad's college friend's daughter that we met, um, who live in Devon. Shout out to them if you're watching this. But yeah, we went to go meet them, which was really nice. And then we went to go to see their farm because they've got like a dairy farm. And then we just went around Clavelli really. This afternoon we've just been around the pool, relaxing. And it's really, it's still really hot. It's like 29 degrees and it's like 6 p.m. Which is just crazy because like usually it's not that hot. But. So I'm just gonna get ready for tonight now. And they're great, Jenny desserts. What sort of Jenny is it? It's Okay, we're just about to go out for our evening meal. You can't really see because my camera covers my whole dress. Um, it's just like this dress from Sheen. I might pull it down a bit because, you know, parents might not be very happy. But yeah, I've also got my glasses on, which are like purple. I don't know if you can see. But they're the same colour as my dress. I just think it looks pretty sick. So, yeah. I might show you what I eat, but I always forget to film. Because, like, I feel like I haven't filmed much at all, but... Also, this towel's so ugly, ignore that. Today's our last evening, which is really sad because I just want to stay here. Like, I literally want to move to Devon because I've literally fallen in love with, like, surfing and, like, the whole beach lifestyle. Like, that is my dream. So, like, I really want to move here, but obviously not going to happen. I'll see you guys in a bit. For tea, I had spaghetti bolognese and I had ice cream for dessert. I'm just going to show you a little bit of our hotel. There's an indoor pool here. And then out there, there's the outdoor pool, which I showed you guys earlier, and then the bar there. Hi 
everyone so i've just got back to the hotel room um i filmed a clip of the indoor pool but, but it closes at half nine so that's that's why no one's in it um yeah he thinks that i look cool with my purple sunglasses and my purple dress like i think i look pretty sick not gonna lie but yeah we're going home tomorrow i think we're going like oh what time are we setting off i'm not quite sure yet. because on the way here it took seven hours which is a bit of a joke no it took eight hours really busy near bristol um so that kind of held us up a lot but on the way back tomorrow hopefully it'll take like six hours if we have a break because it usually take it's meant to take five hours or like five hours and ten minutes or something we're gonna like plan something tomorrow morning but like we're gonna go to maybe bath like on the way because it's sort of on the way but then it's kind of a like half an hour diversion so we're like no um and then we're gonna go to like Toronto. we're probably just gonna stay around the pool and make the use of the facilities at the hotel i'm sorry that i haven't vlogged a lot like done many talkie clips but it'll mostly just be montages with music and um, i just tried to enjoy myself and i didn't want to like talk all the time but yeah i'll see you guys tomorrow for the rest of the vlog Good morning guys, I actually look dead and I feel dead because I literally slept for one hour, one hour last night because basically, you know how I'm like 17 and not an adult yet, so they put like a little kid bed on the floor and it's really uncomfortable. So, and also this room isn't great, like the hotel's really nice, like the pool's nice, the food's nice, everything. It's just the rooms, but that's because we haven't got one of the converted ones because they have, they have modernised like half of them I think some of them have a balcony and stuff but ours is like the old one and it's just really not that nice so yeah that's a bit annoying but my, i need to hurry up because my family have left me because they're at breakfast and apparently i was taking too long even though i haven't done anything i literally just brushed my hair and it's still naughty that last morning today and then we're off home so it's quite sad um but yeah i'll see you guys in a bit for breakfast i had a pan of chocolate and some toast and then i went back to the pool for my last swim which was quite sad it was a lovely day it was really really warm and here's me and my mum um mother and daughter calls and then i had a coke just in the changing rooms because we're like changing to go home because we've um, checked out of our room um, the head and it's just a view of the indoor pool and uh, the hotel was great it was just the rooms that weren't brilliant and then we headed back to the car to go home so i'm just in the car on the way home now and we're just approaching nottingham i think so it shouldn't be too long i just started editing my um devon vlog and what you're watching right now i'm not sure yet if i'm gonna make it into two vlogs or just one depends on how long it is because i've still got to import some more clips from my phone and stuff yeah, i'll probably talk to you guys when i get home um because it's quite noisy for me so yeah i'll see you guys in a bit okay so it's actually not like later on basically i was so tired i forgot to end the video so i'm gonna do it here it's like a couple of weeks after now uh, honestly I had such an amazing time in Devon it was honestly one of the best holidays ever just because like although we were in England like the weather was amazing like the hotels were nice the people that I met were really nice it was just a really good holiday I really enjoyed it and um, I really recommend going to North Devon the beaches are amazing and the whole like vibe down there is so nice I literally love surfing like I discovered one of my favorite sports like I literally love surfing I'm gonna go basically I live about an hour away from the nearest place where I can go surfing Scarborough so hopefully I'm gonna go there. If any surf boys are out there that want to like you know hit me up then feel free because I'd love to like be a little surf girl so <laughs> but yeah I really hope that you guys enjoyed the vlog I absolutely love filming it and editing it especially. Okay, give it a big thumbs up if you did and subscribe to my channel if you're new and I'll see you guys all next week for a new video. Bye!